Hello and Namaste. This is Jewel from Goddess Creative. I have a reading that I promised for July and it is a reading for members and the reading is for Quant. Q-U-A-N-T. Um, it's it's search is QNT, QNT. Okay, so this one, um, I just did a little meditation and got some prices for it. It does get back to its all time high. I realize it's currently right now in the timeline of 2023. It's having a little bit of battle and struggle going on. So that is what's happening with it right now. It is feeling really quite up against it with the Seven of Wands. It is coming through seeming like it's really got a fight for its status. It's really got a fight for what's going on. And it is, yes, just feeling that whole... Um, Standing your ground situation is what Quant is doing currently right now. Um, very much standing up for its beliefs and fighting in your corner, feeling protective and defensive, probably with the you know the drop in price and everything. But it's really quite a um, crazy crisis time right now that we're going. through through this time in history is what I'm meaning for all the financial markets but not just the financial markets just for humanity in general it's a, a really um, unusual time that we are going through so this one this seven of wands is very much in the timeline of right now 2023 it's a determined and challenging um, card for its energy right now. It's um, opposing and stamina, it's holding its own, it's taking the high road, it's maintaining control and feeling very territorial right now. So that's its energy currently in the current timeline. As I said, as we look further along, I get the Emperor and with the Emperor, that is, it's a really lovely card, such a strong card of stability and structure. This is, you know, really great to see in this timeline of 2025 come, oh, sorry, the end of 2024 come 2025. So I don't actually see it, well, I'm just with checking my spirit, I didn't actually get it getting back to its all-time high until... Um, early 2000 and well yeah mid to early not mid but more first quarter I will say of 2025 is what I'm getting um, but the Emperor is about structure protection authority control It's very practical energy here it's about focus and discipline it's logical it's practical it's it is about stability and dependability you know, it is very much um, like a father figure, strong, holding its own. So this will happen for this project is what I'm getting. So that is really nice to see. And as we move further ahead, I got the Page of Swords um, in the timeline of 2026. So... This is some delayed news, but patience is needed. So I, I actually got nice prices for the timeline of 2026. Um, but it is about, you know, being somewhat vigilant and protective and guarded. Um, but also I get, you know, I do get changes. I don't get that this one will fade 
or anything like that. But I do get that this one will change and it'll come after the timeline of 2026, this change will start to happen. Now it could be a change or a merger or something like that, but it's, stru it's like it's structural change or something will change with this project. I don't get it fading away, not at all. Um, but patience is needed here. It is This um, Page of Swords is about ideas and inspiration, planning. So that's what's happening in the timeline of 2026 for this particular project. Its overall energy is the Justice card, which is absolutely beautiful. The Justice does bring forth with it, you know, a lot of balance. And Justice is, you know, it is does bring forth the, you know, the culmination of the journey as well. It's consequences. It's, you know, um, integrity, honesty, integrity, cause and effect, life lessons is the justice card. It is all, the scales is all about balance. So this is coming forth with this project, this balance, this bringing forth of this justice energy, which is, uh, you know, an absolutely stable, beautiful um, energy to bring forth for this project. And I do very much get that that this is its overall energy um, overall. But um, so I wanted to ask more about this, what I was getting in my meditation, which was about a change for this project. And when I asked um, in the tarot for this, about this, um, we get another Wands card, which is, you know, very much about passion, but Wands, I do very much get about, um, particularly with this Three of Wands, is, a, again, forward planning, moving forward, self-confidence, self-belief, freedom, success, it is, um, very much happy with the outcomes, its choices, its its hard work has paid off. So it's, and of course the Three of Wands, as you can see by the picture on this card, is particularly about moving forward and change or travel. Because you see, you can see he's setting off in the, and, and turning his back on, you know, what, has gone before to move and forge ahead to what is um, what is coming forth, what is um, in the future. So it is a little bit dark here in the in the surrounding, but if you look forward, it's a quite light. So he's setting off on a journey. So this is this project very much setting off on a journey is the Three of Wands. So it is about um, moving forward and foresight and forward planning and moving, yeah, um, moving ahead and hard work paying off and happy with choices and outcome is what I'm getting here. So I get that this particular project after the timeline of 2026, it does not fade away, but it merges or changes in some, and you know, this could be to do with legality possibly with the justice card here, but I do get it moving ahead and changing, but I get it, um, but it actually goes from strength to strength. So that's a really positive thing for this particular project of quant, um, Q-N-T. So yes, remembering this is not financial advice, do your own research and due diligence before investing in any um, project and any, you know, never invest more than what you can afford. But yeah, I'm liking this. I like what I get for this. I like the prices I got for this. So yeah, I'm seeing this as still a strong project going forward. Uh, no matter what it becomes in the future, it'll still be here, but it does merge or change into something else is what I'm getting after that timeline of 2026. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed this reading. 
Love and appreciation, namaste.